So I thought I'd film uh, an unboxing of a Filofax A5 Metropole. It's a zipped black organiser. I got it from Amazon. I only ordered it yesterday afternoon tea time and it got delivered about an hour ago. So I'm looking forward to it. Currently I use um, poker pads and a diary that I carry around with me when I do my coaching and my lessons every day when I'm not locked down during Covid. So I'm carrying two pads. I'm carrying a poker pad and a thick diary. So I thought I'd combine everything and put it together into this organiser. So let's see, let's see what we got. So I'm making this video because when I was looking to buy Filofax, the one that I saw on Amazon, this Metropole one with the zip, I couldn't find a recent um, video clip showing me what's in there. So open it up. Usual thing in the box, get rid of that. And there's a little protective sleeve around it. So I think that'll just slide off like that. And then in here, there's a plastic covering around this as well. So how does this come off is the question. Ah, there we go, that slides out as well. So protective screen around it. So this is what what we've now got. Filofax logo there at the front. Zipped all the way around. Filofax on the zip fastener. Yeah, that's it feels nice. It's not it's not leather. I think it's it's sort of fake UPVC leather, but it's very soft. Um, I, I quite like the size of it. These are my these are my pucker pad sizes. So that's what it's going to replace. As I said, I carry a pucker pad and a, a thick diary, so this is going to replace it all. So let's open it to see what we've got. Very smooth. There we are. We're in. So at this side here, again you've got the Filofax logo at the front there. Then there are six oh, one, two, three. There are six sort of card slots, then a little wallet at the end there for either your bank cards, credit cards, or your business cards. Then room under there as well. There's a bit of um, padding under there to protect the springs. Remove that. That's what it looks like. Looks nice, feels nice. So what we've got, what we've got inside it. So it's all protected by this film here. Yep, that slides off. Get rid of that. So there's like a plasticky front sheet there with file effects written on it. So here we go. Open up. So we've got one, two, three four, five, six dividers there, which will come in handy. So when I'm coaching, I can keep for the day or the different days or weeks, I can keep the players uh, programs separate. So that's good. To do pages, one, two, three, four to do pages. Double sided. What we've got next? We've now got how many is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight sheets of two sided lined paper. Then we've got some, what do you call that, graph paper, square paper. Four sheets of that. 
double sided then we have got some blank pages one two three four five six seven eight blank pages then we come to the contact section that's got name address telephone number mobile number post um, email address and name and home address so we've got one two three four five five a page so we've got double sided again one two three four five six seven eight eight contact pages which are double sided and five of each so that's then we've come to some colored colour paper I'm colour blind so I can't tell you what colour it is but it's got very thin lines on it so there's different colours if I can try and find out where they oh, there they separate there so how many sheets of that there was one two three four five six seven eight sheets of that colour probably yep yeah, eight sheets of that colour I think it changes here what is it eight and eight more sheets again sorry about the colours I don't know what colours they are but hopefully you can see them then there's a bit of Filofax advertising promotion in the middle here um, telling you what is available Oh no, it's telling me it's a week on two week page diary. Week on two week page diary. So, here we are, 2021. We've just gone into the February. It's the 7th of February today. So start of 2021. So over the page, so that's 2021. Then over the page, we've got last year, 2020's full year diary. And then 2022's full year diary we then go into personal information the usual things name address telephone number mobile email business national insurance number passport driving license car reg i'm not sure i'm going to be putting all that information onto this page here just in case it does get lost um, and then so that's in english then over the page is in different languages there uh, don't know why there we go and um, no oh, more personal information there then we've got a list of religious festivals in 2021 and national information pages here um, it's got it's got country currency ah. And it's telling you public holidays in all of these different countries, January right, th right through to December. It's got the telephone um, number for each country, like England is plus 44, so it's got that listed there. It's got what the website addresses are and what the dialing code is. Then it's got noticeable dates 2021 and they look like British Bank holidays, Australian day there, um, Memorial Day USA, bank holiday. So around the world, Thanks, Thanksgiving Day, Veterans Day. So there's all sorts of uh, notable dates there. Then we've got some Filofax advertising here. Then we've come, what's this, holiday symbols, uh, talent. this list shows country symbols that appear on the diary pages, so for example, JP is Japan. So. Then over the page, and the diary, sorry, the, yep, the diary pages begin, 
So this one starts from the 28th of December, so a few pages from last year, 2020. So I've got Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday on the left hand side, Thursday, Friday and then Saturday and Sunday which is shared in one uh, column here. So, And it's got sort of time slots 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 and the last one up to 8 at night. So there's a couple of lines per hour on each page but then no times on the Saturday and Sunday slots and like I say they're sharing one column. So then January, January, yeah, February. So that's goes all the way through to disappointingly it stops at October twenty twenty one. So I'm disappointed they haven't given me a full year's diary. Started in January. I would have expected it to go through to December. Oh, I'm jumping the gun here. There's another diary refill. I think it's to remind you to buy it for the following year. Over the page. How embarrassing. But here we go. October. <laughs> October through to December and then a couple of days into January. I might scrub that bit. Then we've got some note pages, one, two, three note pages and another Firefax advertising and then we come to the back here we've got a small ruler, so tough plastic material there, flexible. Then we've got this little wallet, which is very soft, and that there will allow you to put some items, small items in there of your choice. Not sure what I'm going to use that for yet. And then coming towards the back, the last thing in there is land paper. There's quite quite a lot of sheets of land paper there. I'm not going to count those. And that sits nicely into a pouch at the back. So that comes out so you can replace that. And there is like a a see-through mesh at the back there so you need to just open your pad and you can slide that into there like that so you can scribble away in meetings make notes in your pad and then you can tear these off and file them because they're already hole punch wherever you want so so, so that's it um, I'm quite pleased with that really. Um, I'm pleased there's a full diary, even though I didn't see it first of all. So that is the Filofax Metropole. So that's going to come in handy. Really looking forward to using that. And it closes up, so hopefully the zip. Yeah, very good. It's nice, it's really soft, it's a nice, nice feel. Yeah. Yeah, lovely. Uh, hope you've enjoyed watching this. Take care.